the 17th of 32 races in the most competitive series in the world. NASCAR Winston Cup comes to Superstation TVS live from Pocono, Pennsylvania. It's the Pennsylvania 500, $1,400,000 at stake for 42 Winston Cup drivers lined up and ready to go. And we're ready to follow you flag to flag through the entire day. Let's go trackside right now as Governor Tom Ridge and his son Tom Jr. get ready to give the call to put it underway. Gentlemen, start your engines. It's been a bittersweet year for Joe Nemechek. In March, he lost his brother John to a tragic racing accident. In May, he won a big bush race at Charlotte. Call him front row Joe today. He's got his second pole, and he's gunning for his second Winston Cup victory. And behind him, his teammate, Wally Dallenbach, starts third. Let's go to Glenn Jarrett. The Econolog starting grid for the second time. Joe Nemechek is on the pole at better than 168 miles an hour. Ernie Urban alongside. In row two today, it's Wally Dallenbach, best qualifying spot in Dale Jarrett. Row three has Dale Earnhardt and Jeff Gordon ready to work. For row four, Ken Schrader and Jeff Green. Up for row five is Mark Martin and Bobby Labonte. In row six, Skinner and Grissom. At row seven, you have John Andretti and Jimmy Spencer. Row eight today is Bill Elliott and Daryl Waltrip. In row nine, Jeremy Mayfield and Kenny Wallace. Down to row 10, you have Ricky Rudd and Jeff Burton. For row 11, it's Texas Terry Labonte and Ted Musgrave. Row 12 is Sterling Marlin and Hot Strickland. Row 13, Michael Waltrip and Rick Mass. In row 14, Dick Trickle, Bobby Hamilton there. In the 15th row, Derek Cope flanked by Robbie Gordon. 16th row, Brett Woodine and Ward Burton. In row 17, Morgan Shepard and Kyle Petty. Row 18, Jerry Nado and Chad Little. Row 19 is Ricky Craven and Jeff Bodai. For row 20, it's Rusty Wallace and Johnny Benson ready to work. In row 21, Dave Marcus and David Green among the provisional starters. Make it or break it. Getting ready for a start. Ready Joe Nemechek here. brings them down. Second career pole, seventh for Chevrolet in 97. Green flag, green flag. Green, 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 green. Got a green. Five wide. Up on the high bank in turn one. Nemechek. Pushes it up in front by two lengths. Well, boy, you can see Wally Dollar back up front as you ride along here into that side battery car of Jeff uh, Burton. As they go down into turn three, you can see Kenny Wallace there in the 81 as they head into the top of turn. Oh, we've got trouble. That is Walshup in trouble. Spin big red, yeah. Back underway. Yellow is out. They're going to have caution. Trouble on the tunnel turn. Everybody's the second turn. Collect them back up and keep going. Yellow is out as they come Critical to the on this first lap. The cars need to get single file, and they just couldn't do it. You can see Jimmy Spencer there in the yellow and purple car. It looked like he might have gotten the back of Waltrip. When you go down in that corner, everybody kind of checks up to get through their single file. Looks like it may have been a little contact as they got Look in the his turn. in car camp. Okay, this is heading down in the turn three. You see just in front of him, Andretti there in the RCA car. You can see right there, he just got sideways. You couldn't really tell whether anybody bumped him or not. Bill Elliott just getting by from Mark Martin's vantage point. Yeah, I would have to say that he and uh, Jimmy Spencer just had a light tap there. And it's so easy. Jarrett, Musgrave, Gordon Burton would love flag, to get Ernie Irvin a lap down. This is the opportunity. Let's see what they can do with it. He's on the tail end of the lead lap as we take green at lap 127. And they thunder down into turn number one.
You've got three cars that got their lap back on that restart. Not only Ernie Irving, but you've got Ward Burton and also got Dick Trickle back in the lead lap. That gets us up towards 120, let's see, 21, 22, 22 cars in that lead lap. Look at Ernie Urban. Oh, trouble over oh. the tunnel, tunnel turn. Trey Levante getting Earn turn one. Right Earnhardt's right number three. Right Kenny right Wallace right getting right caught in it. Bill right Elliott right down right against the got inside got wall there. Oh, you see Joe Nemechek. Derek Cope. A race back to the line. Fourth position. Huh. A break for Ernie Urban. A break for Dick Trickle. Boy, it was not a break for Dale Earnhardt. Look at the right front corner. Demolished on it. Earnhardt on the bottom in the number three. You see Bobby, Bobby Labonte get into his brother Terry Labonte. This triggers a chain reaction. You see everybody swept into it behind him. And Earnhardt's about to collect number five, Terry Labonte. Nowhere to go. There's Bobby Hamilton scooting through. Bodine on the outside getting by. Brett Bodine on the brakes. Derek Cope sliding. And forth to the track together. I don't think they will today. Take a look again. And that was after first contact. Whoa, I see one car, Joe Nemechek, went way up in the air in the 42 there. You see him in the middle part of the screen there. He almost got upside down there. Second angle from Mark Martin. was talking about the potential for someone to turn this race around. Lead change. Jarrett to the inside, and the crowd goes wild. 139,000 people up. Yay or nay on this one. Jarrett puts the Ford back in front of Burton. You can see the crowd. Uh, Any time that Jeff Gordon get past anymore, the crowd really reacts. But look at third place there. Musgrave is really on a tear right now. Running third and closing in on Spencer. Field. Right up there. The front four all together. And then just about 12 car lengths back. Comes that number 99. Jeff Burton in fifth. Skinner in sixth. Benson is seventh. Labonte. Raven. Whoa, Whoa trouble. Ernie Irvin in the wall. Yellow is down. You could hear the scream of the tires, and you saw the impact. Ernie Urban down in turn one. You know, it hadn't been long ago. Dale Jarrett reported he's having trouble getting a bite on his... Oh, look at Ted Musgrave, though. He's trying to move in here. He wants to lead this race. Yeah, they come down to finish this lap off. They race back to the line and around this two-and-a-half-mile track. It is a run. Here's Musgrave pulling up. He's coming after Jarrett as they come to the line for caution. Okay. It'll be Jared first, Musselmania 500. Well, I know that's the four car there, Sterling Marlin. Whether they had any contact getting in the corner, you really couldn't tell, but I, t I can tell you this. Ernie Irvin hit very hard on the driver's side. It's good to see him out of the car and not injured. Yeah, that is the best news of all. They have lost a car, but he is Make okay. A mistake when you're fighting like that. Yeah, but he doesn't have the pressure anymore now. He just, he's starting to hear the gremlins in that car, though. Yep. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> Got him by three seconds right now. The intimidator may be Earnhardt, but the dominator here today is the 88. DJ's getting it done. Coming by, white flag about to be extended. Final lap. Down and out of three. Dale Jarrett, one Come on, lap Catfish. away. One more time. Be smooth. You got it. One more time. Be smooth. That he has been all day. Todd Parrott's talking to him. You could hear him in the background there. Dale Jarrett's doing everything right right now. And I think right now he's kind of in cruise mode and taking it easy. But look at Jeff Burton come in on, as you pointed out just a second ago, he is moving in just a little bit on Gordon. Just digging. 
is 99. Burton coming after Gordon here in the final lap. Jarrett swings it around for the final time out to the wall. Short shoot. Pulls away. Gordon seems to have him covered again. Gets back a couple of car lengths from Burton. Checkered flag about to be extended. And the winner of the 24th <laughs> annual <laughs> Pennsylvania 5. Got the best in the world right there, eight. boy. Good job, DJ. Finally got this puck. Good over. job, DJ. Dale yeah, Jarrett has done it. Awesome. Yeah, the kid looked good. Not a great Hope call you're feeling a little better after you saw that one today. Yes, indeed. It's Dale Jarrett headed for victory lane. Uh, we'll be there to join him in just a moment. Be a pretty happy occasion for those folks. Gordon gets second, job, Burton Todd third. Musgrave finishes in fourth. Good job from the 28. 